Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Candy. After I post the Canon Cable ID product video to my YouTube channel weeks ago, some people asked me what it is about. Why not using small label printer for labeling? Well, in this video, I will share my personal views on the Cable ID printer to you. Hope my videos will answer most of your questions and your doubts. Before I start, please remember to give me a like and subscribe to my channel first. It is free and it will help me a lot to grow this channel and provide better and richer content to you. Cable ID printer prints up labels for us to label the cable and wires. These cable ID printers are designed to print on different types of specialized marking material, not just the normal sticker label, but also supporting PVC tubes like this. This is the PVC tubes, ID stripes, web around tape, heat string tubes, plates, etc. Here, I'm using the term marking, not label. It means that the printer is creating different type of markers for electricians or wiremen to attach it to the correspondent cables or wires. These materials are durable and long-lasting. It resists different types of harsh environment in different industries such as high temperature area, moisture, chemicals, and so on. In this type of environment, you will not want your paper label catch fire and burn off the cables and wires. Secondly, cable ID printers create long-lasting printouts. As you know, electrical cables and wires will wear out over time. Some cables like network cables might need to upgrade to the latest version with the technology advancement. By that time, this type of paper-based label printed with normal printer might be faded or damaged over the time. Imagine if the projects like building constructions or any industrial type that has hundreds and thousands of cables flying here and there, without the cable labeling or cable ID, how the technicians or wiremen can find the correct cable for troubleshooting. It is not just time wasting over the manual search, but also dangerous to the technicians if they cut the wrong cables. Therefore, it is important to have a proper cable marking so that we can prevent all these potential risks and inconvenience. There are different types of cable marking printer in the market. As you can see here, I have two Canon cable ID printer. This is the MK1500. You can see it is in blue color. On my right side is the MK2600 printer. This printer is in black color. MK1500 is an entry model cable ID printer while MK2600 is higher-end models which offers more features and function. Let me share with you the key features of both models and their differences. These two printers share almost similar outlook. Both are equipped with the keyboard and backlit LCD display. However, if you see clearly, MK2600 comes with more functions on its keyboard, which I will cover in the later part of the video. For the MK2600, it comes with additional USB cable and CD driver. User can compile the database in PC and transfer to the printer for printing or storage. MK1500 has a print speed up to 25 mm per second. 
which provides approximately 35 pieces of cube sprinting for every minute. Compared to MK2600, MK2600 support faster print speed at 40 mm per second, approximately 42 pieces per minute. In case if your projects require a lot of data printing, MK2600 is a better option for you. MK1500 supports up to two line printing, while MK2600 offers up to three lines printing. Although this model offers up to three lines printing, however, the three lines printing is only limited to 1.3 mm character size only. It might be a bit small to read. Both MK1500 and MK2600 support different types of media printing, such as label tape, heat string tape, PVC marking tape, ID stripes, and web around tape. However, for this higher end model, it can support up to 10 mm plate printing. As you can see on the screen, these are the medias that support by the Canon ID printer. Compared to MK1500, MK2600 provides more simple input and printing. This is a good news for the electricians or wireman. Electrician or wireman can print different types of electrical symbols as marking rather than key long words. In case if they want to highlight certain words, such as hazard or dangerous word, they can add in the frame to the printing so that the marking is more eyeball catching. Both MK1500 and MK260 provide the convenience of auto numbering system. Let's say you have 10 different LAN cables, you don't need to create 10 different entries in the database. With the auto numbering system, it will help to create the numbers automatically, whether it's numbers, hexadecimals, etc. It will save up a lot of spaces, cleaner input, and use lesser memory. Both models come with built-in memory. User can store the database into the printer and call it up anytime for any future project printing. As mentioned earlier, MK2600 support PC connectivity where users can compile and create all the database from their PC before saving them into the printer. Of course, MK2600 comes with larger built-in memory. It supports up to 60,000 characters or 10 folders and each folder can save up to 99 files. While for the MK1500 only supports up to 7,500 characters or 20 files only, which is about 9 times lesser compared to the MK2600. Both models support horizontal and vertical text printing. It provides easier reading direction for the electricians or the wireman when they are searching the correct cables. Besides that, both models support lead adjustment, length adjustment, and vertical adjustment. It allows user to adjust the spacing and position of the print out so that the whole printed label tape can fit nicely to, let's say, the electrical fuse box. Both models support half cut and full cut feature. This is called half cut. The half cut feature allows user to break the print out manually before inserting it to the cables. In case the cutting is no longer sharp, you can always purchase the cutter set from Canon, tear out the blunt one from the printer, and replace with the new one.
Both models comes with one set of 100 meter black ribbon cassette. In case if you want to print on the dark color media, such as the black color heat shrink tube, you can get the white color ribbon cassette from Canon and print white text onto the dark color media. And lastly, only MK2600 support PC connectivity. User can create and copy all their database in the PC and print or store into the printer. That's all for my video today. Hope my video will help you better understanding the cable ID printer. Please remember to subscribe to my channel. I will need your support to help me to grow this channel better. See you in next video. Bye-bye.